but I mean, like, I don't scare them. They're, I'm not afraid of them. They're people too. Right now. It's, the police are definitely <laughs> part of the 99%. Uh, you know, I've always, I've said that plenty of times. I think, you know, as far as, as who really is a part of us, I think the police force definitely is. You know, I just, I, I, you know, it's just disappointing to see the corporations, you know, kind of utilizing that as a way to break apart um, the, the debate. Instead of it being us against the corporations, it's becoming Occupy against the police department, which is really not the purpose. It's not what we're going after at all. Would you agree with that? I agree with that. And um, the whole thing with police being the 99%, the moment they take off their badges and join our ranks, that's when they'll join us. As, as far as I'm concerned, as long as they're wearing their badges and still serving the corporate machine, they're no better than the 1%. My glasses are currently broken because a police officer broke them back in New York a while ago. I can't afford new glasses. So, no, they're not the 99%. They are they're puppets to the 1%. They're class traders, thank you. Yeah, they're a bunch of class traders who are selling their comrades out just for a little bit of money. They're not being any better than the corporations. The moment that they defy their orders and join our ranks, that's when they'll join the 99%. Now, how do you feel as far as with Bradley Manning?